before I'm talking about um, and, um, the origins of that plantation, now to, let's say uh, the, a, bit, a bit a bit about the history of the farming. Some is imported, some uh, from the colonial time. Uh, experience from the front. For example, in Vietnam, during the front colony time, uh, the front brought here different kind of plantation, mm -hmm. industrialized, mm -hmm. industrialized uh, plant. For example, like coffee, rubber, um, and so on. So for in order to serve for the like, uh, to you know, get the benefit from that, and then after that, currently is from the market economy uh, another kind of external plant for example acacia or rubber mm -hmm. uh, came here uh, more of them like acacia and rubber plantation they come from the australia mm -hmm. um, at the beginning the australian some like um, like australian company that come here they co do cooperation with the Vietnamese company in order to promote the farmer especially in the north of vietnam to grow the agats uh, uh, in tooth for the meal factory, like a new paper. Mm -hmm. And then from that, it's expanding, expanding to the south, central and the south of Vietnam. See? Nowadays, many farmers, they recognize the acacia create negative impact to the environment. For example, like uh, it makes the soil become harder and cannot grow anything under the eucalyptus uh, and now they already quit to stop to, stop to grow um, like, uh, eucalyptus uh, and then another tree interview, uh, a continuing interview from Australia in order to replay the eucalyptus is acacia yeah, acacia is better than like, uh, eucalyptus that it can somehow um, improve the uh, housing is not really effective to the soil. But if you grow like a house mono, mm -hmm. and then one time you have it one time, mm -hmm. it means it's open, mm -hmm. so it creates ero erosion mm -hmm. to the soil. And also, the much more serious mm -hmm. impact from that is it stimulates the farmer to cut down the forest in order to replace by mm. Asia. Mm.